you know, when one uh, goes through great trauma in life, and this is trauma for all of us, uh, what are you grateful for? From my point of view, uh, our marriage and having a lifelong partner who you've got so much in common with, you can enjoy even hard times if you take the simple things of life and you enjoy them with somebody. It does make a difference in life. Nobody knows how this is. There are no books here to study. There are no experiences to have. What you do know is the human spirit is extraordinary. And no matter what's happened in life, so this will pass and one will be around again in the new world which once it's over will also be the old world and hopefully we've learned from this and these are the things one's grateful for because uh, you look back on a life and uh, that's what your legacy is, that's what your achievement is. How did you bring up your family and how did they turn out? How did you work for so many years with so many people? And did you improve their lives? Did they live better because they were part of your life and they worked hard with you, for you, around you, kind of delivering your philosophies to what you've created? And if you can sit back now and you say to yourself, I am grateful, I'm grateful for my life, I'm grateful for the people I surrounded myself with who allowed me to deliver my aims and philosophies. And we're grateful. We're grateful for everything all of you do. We're grateful for the effort you make that is a, you know, as far as we're concerned, our legacy. So to everyone today, that is my message. Thank you for who you are, what you are, and what you've done, and what you'll continue to do. And I only look forward, still at my age, to a happy, prosperous future where we pass this, we solve it, and move on so that all of you continue to have good, wonderful, happy lives. So we end up by saying thank you, everybody.